Kendall, who is your least favourite member of Taylor Swift's squad? It's no secret that Kendall Jenner and Selena Gomez have had a tumultuous friendship, with Taylor Swift being the one to expose the truth about Kendall's mean behavior towards Selena. Despite her denial, there is an overwhelming amount of evidence that suggests Kendall is nothing more than a ruthless, backstabbing mean girl who has no qualms about using and manipulating her friends for her own gain. Even more disturbing is the fact that Taylor, who has always been a loyal friend to Selena, has been privy to this cruel behavior for years and only recently decided to speak out against it. We'll find out each and everything possible, but before, let me ask you one question. Are you a die-hard fan of celebrity gossip and don't want to miss out on latest news and scandals? Subscribe to Celebrity Fix and stay atop the latest celebrity news and gossip. What are some of the misconceptions that you've heard about yourself? Oh my god. Uh, so many things. I think the one that I guess hurts the most is that people think I'm a mean girl, because that's just not the case. It can be upsetting when someone is questioning your character, and if only, like, people knew me. It's a well-known fact that Kendall Jenner and Selena Gomez were once part of Taylor Swift's inner circle, also known as her squad, but their friendship came to a dramatic end in 2014. According to sources, Kendall allegedly plotted to ruin Selena's relationship with Justin Bieber and even went as far as to spread rumors that Justin never truly loved Selena. Not only that, but it is claimed that Kendall took pleasure in making sure Selena found out about these rumors, causing more pain and heartache for her former friend. This kind of ruthless and calculated behavior is the epitome of a mean girl, and it's clear that Kendall will stop at nothing to tear down those around her in order to get ahead. It's a sad reminder that in the cutthroat entertainment industry, even the closest of friendships can be destroyed by jealousy. A source stated, Selena Gomez left humiliated by Kendall Jenner's flirty texts to Justin Bieber. Selena doesn't trust her motives. They fought and split. There have been allegations that Selena Gomez's 2014 breakup with Justin Bieber was caused by his involvement with Kendall Jenner. According to sources, Selena was reportedly furious when she found out about flirty messages between the two and even allegedly walked in on them in bed together. Additionally, there are claims that the Jenner sisters, Kylie and Kendall, had spoken poorly of Selena, calling her fake and uncaring. These rumors and reports have created a significant amount of controversy and speculation surrounding the relationships and dynamics among the group of celebrities. According to fans, the Jenner sisters, Kylie and Kendall, were not only to have spoken poorly of Selena Gomez, but also to have disregarded the fans and the recognition they gave to Selena. The source adds that they even said that if Selena had received an award, she would accept it and laugh at the people who voted for her. Furthermore, the source claims that the Jenner sisters' alleged behavior towards Selena would not be well received by Taylor Swift a close friend of Selena, who would be disappointed and possibly upset with Kendall for treating Selena in the same way Kendall allegedly treated Taylor after her 2013 breakup with Harry Styles. The source also suggests that Kendall and Harry had a romantic relationship twice despite they had an agreement not to date each other, which would have caused further tension between the group of celebrities, adding more fuel to the fire of the ongoing controversies and speculations surrounding their relationships. How somebody could be your best friend and your companion and your most trusted person in your life and then they could go and become your worst enemy who knows how to hurt you because they were once your tr most trusted person. On Instagram in April of 2021, Kendall shared a picture of herself wearing a dress with a daisy printed road art pattern. As soon as she posted a picture of herself in the dress, Selena's admirers noticed that the dress she was wearing was strikingly similar to one of the dresses that Selena wore in one of her music videos. If Kendall had simply kept quiet about the situation, everything would have turned out well because it is not unusual for celebrities to advertise the very same designer. Fans speculated that Kendall retweeted the post because she was aware that people were contrasting her performance in the dress with that of Selena's. However, in a tweet that Kendall cited a comment that suggested she would wear the dress better than anyone else. 
The tweet from a Kendall fan account said, Kendall Jenner pulling off this dress better than anyone else. The record for being the meanest girl in history does not even come close to that held by Selena. After Kendall got into a disagreement with her sister Kylie, Corey Gamble confronted Kendall and accused her of being nasty and mean after the incident. During the dispute, Kendall claimed that Corey sided with Kai Lee, but the next day, when the two of them discussed the incident, Corey stated that Kendall has always been rude. Annalise Mischler, a YouTuber, detailed an incident in which Kendall was rude to her, as well as to a large number of other people, including several friends and family members. In 2014, a waitress who was questioned by Page Six stated that Kendall never left a tip and walked out without paying for a bill that was $60. When the she reportedly raced after Kendall to ask her to pay the bill, Kendall allegedly threw money in her face, and then she and her pals joked about it. And we were all like, talking and hanging out and like playing video games, I think, even, and just like eating goldfish. And she was sitting there on the bed the whole time, not saying a word. If someone asked her a question, if he, like, talked to her, she would just be like, no. Nah. Like, just, like, literally so snippy, so negative, so just rude. In addition to the previous accusations, there have been other incidents that have led to criticism of Kendall Jenner's behavior and accusations of her being a mean girl. One such incident occurred in 2016, when Talia Storm claimed that Kendall had tried to get her kicked out of a pool party by talking negatively about her on social media. According to Talia's friend, who was also at the party, the bouncer initially refused to remove Talia since she had been in the VIP section before Kendall arrived. However, it is reported that Kendall allegedly went to find a second bouncer and attempted to have Talia removed again. Talia tweeted, It's a sad day when you upstage Kendall Jenner and she tries to get you thrown out the VIP area at the next radio app pool party. LOL hashtag she tried and failed. Furthermore, there have been reports of Kendall not tipping her bartender in a Brooklyn bar, baby's all right, and instead leaving the tip blank. The bar posted a receipt photograph which showed Kendall's signature on a $24 bill and captioned it, Don't forget to tip your bartender. Kendall defended herself by claiming that she had tipped the bartender in cash, but the incident still led to criticism of her behavior and accusations of her being rude and inconsiderate. At the 2018 Met Gala, fans have claimed that Kendall was incredibly rude and dismissive when she allegedly pushed a security guard out of her way, and later that same day, fans reported that they saw her pushing another assistant out of her way. Watch out, you're gonna hit her. This behavior was seen as arrogant and disrespectful. The same year, Kendall was also alleged to have been mean to her fellow models in the industry when she called them out for not being more selective with their jobs. In an interview with Love Magazine, Kendall reportedly said that she had been very selective about her job and chose her projects accordingly, which was seen as a direct attack on her peers. She stated, Since the beginning we've been super selective about what shows I would do. I was never one of those girls who would do like 30 shows a season or whatever the fuck those girls do. More power to them. Before we move on to the most interesting part of the video, don't forget to subscribe to our channel for exclusive content and behind the scenes of celebrity scandals. Even Nick Jonas, who had a romantic involvement with Kendall in 2015, has reportedly called her mean and they broke up because Nick couldn't stand her attitude. But he changed the topic and said that they just hang out when they are in the same city and talking about their breakup, he said, I don't know, it's too early, I'm focused on my work, and that, to me, is the priority right now. These accusations and controversies have led to a negative perception of Kendall as a person and have reinforced the idea of her being a mean girl in the industry. While giving an interview to Vogue, she talked about her anxiety issues and said, The moment that I schedule it and I know it's happening, to the moment it actually happens, I will think about it constantly and it'll just eat me alive and I won't be able to forget about it. The day I'm getting ready to go, I just have so much anxiety that it feels like my blood is like boiling and I'm like shaking, like my mouth is dry. If people are really judging her without context, we wouldn't be surprised if we see photos of Selena and Kendall being besties. So what do you guys think about Kendall's personality? Is she really mean or rude? Or is that something made up to target her career? Let us know about your views in the comments section.
Thank you for watching and if you want to suggest any upcoming video do mention that in comments as well.